Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of ESO Dragonhold. So in the last episode, we went to Pride Home to try to protect it from the cultists. Failed, pretty much. Uh. But we did learn that's actually where they trained the Pride of Alkosh, who are essentially like forgotten mains that became warriors instead. Kinda hard to explain, at least briefly. I forget, we could probably just walk and go. I feel like that's a little bit more time efficient, isn't it? <laughs> but we were able to find the clan mother shortly before she passed. And she told us of a mask we need to find before Ra Kajin does. So we journeyed to this, the temple of Kanarthi or Kanarthi's breath, one of the two, <laughs> where the clan mother told us that we need to go to a statue of the forgotten maid. Okay, which is right down there. So let's go ahead and meet Aelia there, shall we? Hopefully the last episode wasn't too short, a little bit worried that it was. I don't know, never know really until I edit them. But I feel like it's not going to take us a whole lot longer until we're done with this, so... Let's see how far we can get today, shall we? And maybe see if I can make it down this mountain! Oh no! <laughs> I'm dying! Oh no! Okay! Here we are. I believe this is These bells look just like the ones in Kanarthi's Breath Temple. And look, they're all tarnished. Yeah, she said they would be, huh? Clan Mother Tadali was right. The bells are tarnished from neglect. Why don't we perform the cleansing ritual? You just need to press the pedal there to start it. Can you remind me how the cleaning... I, I think I remember. Do I... Okay, I actually have to have her Clan remind Mother me. Tadali was... <laughs> I imagine it will be similar to how you cleanse the bells in Kanarthi's Breath Temple. Yeah. The small bells glow in a certain order. All you need to do is hit the larger bells nearby in the same order. That should cleanse them. That's simple enough. Okay, let's see. We Red. need to hit the big bells in the same order as the little bells. Yellow. They should be it's around very here slow. somewhere. Blue. Green. Okay. So red, yellow, blue, green. It goes like that. All right. Now, let's see. I think this one is the red one. There we go. There's a dragon near us. Great. There's yellow. Is it up there? Yeah, there it is. Kind of hiding back here. Okay. Yellow. Then I think blue. And then green last. Simple enough. You did it. The bells are cleansed. Indeed, they are. All right, hello. <laughs> well done. Come, dragon. <laughs> Didn't know you could just do that. Kedali must prepare you for the trials ahead. Right, okay. Kenarthi calls to you with gentle winds. She can guide you, but never carry you. With cunning, with speed, you must find your own way. Do you accept Kenarthi's blessing? I accept Kenarthi's blessing. The drums of Lorcaj beat strongly. Darkness creeps into your heart and death claws at your throat. With strength, with courage, you must find the light. Will you face Lorcaj's darkness? I will face his darkness. Alkosh watches with a steady eye. His wayward children have forgotten their purpose and threatened to destroy the natural way. With reverence, with virtue, you must claim his mask and mend the threads of time. Will you walk the path with pride? Hi, Udo. She's trying to come mess with all my wires. I will walk the path. Kenarthi, sweet winds, your cash's black heart, light to follow and darkness to thwart. Okay. Uh, Cunning and strength, virtue and pride, may be proved worthy of mask divine. The way is open, and so Tadali's part in this ends. It is up to you now. Dragon Guard. Okay, let's go in. Oh, yes, Aelia already ran in? Yeah, there she is. Oh, it looks like we got more of the, uh... Looks like we'll have to find a way across. The shooty thing. This is a nice little place, though. Let's try not to walk off of it while I take a picture. Don't worry, Aelia, I have something Those for this. Those poles certainly look like grappling points, don't they? Perhaps that's how we make our way across the cavern. 
Or should I say that's how you make your way across the cavern? We only have the one. Aza, I swear to Azura. We only have one what? A grappling bow, of course. Yeah. I confiscated this one from Zaji back in Senchal, but I forgot to return it to Sai Sahan. Th- was it's I not holding on to mine? Use. I feel like Just I was. Just aim, shoot, and hold on tight. If we only have one grappling bow, how will you get across the chasm? We just have to hope there's another path. <sighs> when you reach the other side, look for anything out of the ordinary. I cannot believe it's like, Lever to pull, or something to light. Anything that may help me traverse the chasm as well. <laughs> yeah, okay. Let's go. Well, I'll go. Until winds. The chosen warrior accepts that in the pits of despair, there's always a gentle wind to guide them. But even with guidance, they must walk toward their destiny by their own will. This is the fate of heroes. The chosen warrior follows the path laid before them, their hearts strengthened by their certainty. They become the light that guides all others along the chosen path. Know this, or you will not don the mask. Ooh, okay, okay. Doesn't really help her at all, but let's keep going. So glad this is consistent. <laughs> I was quite worried. Um, ooh, this is also beautiful. Lots of pretty locations in this DLC. Yeah, so it's just a really pretty game, you know? Let's see, can't really make it all the way to that one. Am I missing something? Like, I don't think it will reach that anyway, but that's all I'm seeing. Am I... am I blind? Uh, maybe. Ah, yeah, there it is. Okay. Good. I was a little bit stuck there. But it looks like we just have to go the long way around. <laughs> but this is pretty fun, so I'm not complaining. I like being scooted along by this thing. <laughs> it's quite amusing. Oh, what's this? Trying to Knarthy. Okay, activate that. Whatever you did, it worked. The door just opened. Oh. I'll meet you on the other side. Okay, that's good. <laughs> good work. Now let's see if we can find that mask. Right. Now, am I the cool chosen warrior that gets to wear the mask, or is it gonna be her? <laughs> I am unsure she'll probably get all the credit for all my hard work once again. Clan Mother Tadali said you had to find light in darkness. Why don't you try igniting the braziers? Okay. The chosen warrior must be fearless, even in the face of certain death. They must not allow darkness into their heart. To have no fear of death because one does not value life is easy. This is the deception of the dark. The Chosen Warrior fans the flames that burn in their breast, their heart alight with life and love. They fight because they must, to protect their life and the lives of others. Know this, or you will not don the mask. Alright. So, we need to light some braziers, simple enough. Probably. Hopefully nothing spooky pops out of that door and tries to kill us. Well, not quite out of the door. Get ready to fight! Yeah. That's what I thought. Can never be peaceful, can it? Never just a simple brazier lighting. <laughs> I just pulled him up to me. That's always so fun. Okay, is that all? I need to recharge. No, I need to recharge my sword. Come on, man. Okay. No. No, I don't think I will. Oh, you're the beefy one. Okay, okay. Kind of figured, but she's not really doing anything. She's kind of just sitting there, which is really sad. But I'm also not going to complain. But she definitely takes a while to kill, unfortunately, because I, I I don't do a whole lot of damage. Wait, that that just means I can recharge my weapon real quick. Hold on, just give me a second, because this will help with the whole damage thing. We'll just go ahead and charge that one too. Sure. There we go. Hey, stop that. You're not allowed to do things, remember? Oh, now she's fighting. Well, at least she gave me a nice little pause there. And she's still attacking Aelia, so we're fine. Oh, no, now she's on us. Okay, well. There we go. I don't know, man. Just kill him. Now we gotta do the whole thing over here again, don't we? This is going to take forever. And now we got this one. I thought it said Spirit of Boring at first. <laughs> and they take forever <laughs> to kill. They don't really do much to me, like, at all. Like, literally. Nothing. So it's just kind of a lot of stabbing and they gave my stamina back. Yeah, we're halfway there. So much fighting. <gasps> Wait, there's another person now. Hey, come help me, man. No, they didn't. Okay, well. <laughs> the nerve. Get over here. So annoying. No, no, come back. No, mirror moon now. Okay. 
Fair enough. And another one of these big things. <laughs> well, not really big things, just uh, lots of health things. Wait, I do have a friend here now. Oh, thank Only you so much. My go. god. It takes me so long to kill those. Alright, last one. Oh. Okay, good. Our friend is still here with us. That's great. Yeah, this is a whole lot faster with friends. I appreciate it. <laughs> oh, I was not blocking. There we go. Oh. Yeah, I certainly hope so. It took entirely too long. Boop. There we go. Oh, hello. That was gross. <laughs> Hated that a lot. Why are you in the ground? That ain't normal. <laughs> Ooh, more glowy mushrooms. I like it, I like it. And more weird zombie things. That I like a lot less. <laughs> oh, this guy got backed into a corner. He's confused. Oh well. Better than hitting me. Get down off that rock. <laughs> Dang it. I was really hoping I could get by that one. <laughs> okay, on to the third trial now, please. Now what awaits us in here? Just a hallway so far. <laughs> Sliding stones. Ah, right. You move them onto panels to unlock gates. Yeah, I know, I was there with Casca. Well, kind of. Guess she had to do the same thing too. <laughs> there we go. A gate opened. Yup. Now you just need to find the platform. Okay, I guess we're messing with this one now. Where do you need to go? I assume that's the gate that opened anyway. I can also, yeah, go through here. But that doesn't seem right now. Ah, there's something there. Okay, can I get that all the way over here? Maybe I can. This is pretty fun, I gotta say. <laughs> okay, where was that? Back here? I think so. Yes, okay. Let's get that on over there. There we go. Okay, that means we should be able to get this one through there. Then where? Ah, right there. Okay, good. Oh, not quite. There we go. Yeah, I saw another one up there, so let's go ahead and do that. See what that does for us. I think there were grappling points? Yeah, right there. <laughs> okay. Yeah, let's move that one over here. I assume that's what we need to do anyway. Okay. Let's see, what do we need to do over here, though? There is that. If I move this one, is that going to close something, though? <laughs> It might. I think that just closed the one over there. Okay, that's no big deal. Let's scoot this on in there. There we go. I hope this is the last of these trials. It's not like you're doing a whole lot. <laughs> the mask should be just ahead. Okay. Ooh, yeah, this looks important. That's a statue of Jadari, isn't it? Let's see if there's an inscription. Okay. Here lies Jadari the Endless, founder of the Pride of Alkosh. First champion to the Dragon King of Cats. May she watch over these halls and guide those who do seek the Mask of Alkosh. Okay. Oh, hi! You have both ventured far and come so close, but only one may claim the Mask of Alkosh. You who heard the Clan Mother's dying words, go now and claim that which you earned. Oh, okay. Is that Chidari? Hey, look, she didn't steal my credit. That's pretty nifty. <laughs> well, Jadari has spoken. Only one hero can claim the mask, and that hero seems to be you. Which makes complete sense, of course. You have done the lion's share of these trials. I'm just glad I could help you get this far. What will you do now? I could go back to Sai Sahan and report in. But that doesn't feel right to me. With so much at stake and so little time left, I want to do more to support our cause. You need to think of something only you can do. You're right. I need to focus on my strengths if I want to help the Dragon Guard. I've always been good with diplomacy. Perhaps I can help gather allies. Though I'm not sure who I would even speak to at this point. What about the Shields of Senchal? That's the largest fighting force in Pelotine, right? The Shields of Senchal? Do you really think they would join us? Well, it's worth a try. Besides, we've learned so much about the Order of the New Moon and their plans. Maybe my father will finally understand just how dire this situation is. Hopefully, that'd be nice. Let's go get that mask. 
Okay, we got a long hallway. Creepy. Mm. I am unsettled. Oh. Oh. Oh no. You seek the mask. Very well. My champion awaits. Mm. I don't like that you're here. Not, not one bit. But okay, let's just deal with your little spooky boys. You Naruto running at me, man? Stop that. Like, what are you doing here, man? Ooh, that's cool. Time, oh, cool. Oh, hi. Oh, no, thanks for that. Alright, so we're finally getting to kill this guy. That's good. I don't mind that at all. He's kinda not that great so far. He hasn't really done a whole lot, so... Just a weak little edgy boy, huh? Throwing your knives, doing nothing. Alright, well that's a little cheaty, don't you think? What's the point of having a champion? I can't even do anything to him now. Is that supposed to happen? I am unsure. Okay, I'll just keep whacking at you. <laughs> there we go, now I can. Alright, man. I have the power of God and anime on my side! That's what you sound like. Stop throwing your crappy little knives. They don't even do anything. Back on with this. Mm -hmm. Just avoid the ice. Can't even hit me with that. Well, you kinda did, but... <laughs> Man, you wouldn't be, like, even able to wield it. You just suck all around. Look at your health bar. It's like a halfway. Look at mine. It's full. You are puny. No one can destroy me and my red booty pants. <laughs> he keeps going invisible. That's what it is. But I just immediately knock him out of it. I'll just, I'll just hang out here. Okay, okay. I can suck, man. Can I, can I drag you to me? Oh, you, you'll just come to me. Okay, I appreciate it. Very kind of you to bring yourself to me to die. Oh, he's disappointed in you. You hear that? Your own father disappointed. That's how crap you are, man. Come on, come on. There we go. I was the bee. That's all you had. <laughs> Didn't happen. Sorry, Latvalon. This is mine now. Oh, uh, please don't. Oh, hey, friend. Thank you. Oh, I'm missing something cool. <laughs> Your fight is with me. A challenge. Very well, brother. Let us end this. Okay, I should probably try to go help him. I do not want our dragon friend to die. But I have the mask now, so that's good. Okay, talk to Sai real quick. Seems like we should be trying to help our little our little dragon friend, but okay, I'll talk to Sai again. Oh no, that's a crocodile. Ouch. I always do that, man. <laughs> always gotta fall straight onto threats. Oh, I gotta go all the way back to the, the sanctum. I see, okay. Well, we'll go to the way shrine instead then. Seems like time is of the essence, but okay, okay. I'll, I'll go tell Sai. I guess we do need everyone, don't we? Probably would make sense. Okay, here we are. Looks like he's in there somewhere. He's always gotta be tricky to get to, doesn't he? It's like he slowly gets further and further away every time I gum here. There he is! Uh, hey! You might notice that your, uh, dragon friend is missing. My friend, you look like you've been to oblivion and back. What matter of trial did you face? Quite a few, actually. But I recovered the mask and killed Rakajin. By my honor, that's good to hear. With Rakajin slain and the mask in our possession, we're much closer to victory. It's all because of your efforts. Here, take this. Another interesting item I found in the Sanctum's vault. We'll literally never use this, but okay, thank you. <laughs> With his dragon priest defeated and his plans foiled, Lotvalon is more vulnerable than ever before. We can't let this opportunity pass us by. The time has come to put an end to this order of the new moon. Not full our challenge, Lotvalon, but I don't know where they are. That would also help to know, you know? Sept scales. Why would he challenge Latvalon on his own? This is no time for anger. I may not agree with Nephilar's actions, but we need to defeat the cult. We must find our dragon ally. How do you propose we find Nephilar? Journey to Senchal and speak with General Rembus. I don't expect him to join us in our fight, but he may have reports concerning Nephilar and Latvalon's battle. I'll speak with Rembus then. 
Our task isn't done no yet. No need guard. to travel to Sanchez. Let's discuss our oh, next hi. Guard, General Remus. I owe all of you an apology. I thought I acted for the good of Sanchez. There is blood on my hands. If you'll have us, the shields of Sanchez will fight okay, alongside the Dragon Guard. Very good. We've always been on the same side. I'm glad you finally realized that. All right. You can thank my daughter for all this. She can be quite persuasive when she wants to be. Just like her mother. The shields of Senshal are ready to aid you, Dragon God. We're looking for two dragons battling each other. One red and the other black. Yes, those particular dragons aren't very subtle. There's been an abundance of sightings. The latest reports indicate they were heading north of Senshal in the company of a great deal of cultists and several dragons. Any idea where they're headed? Not yet. I have a contingent of soldiers stationed at the West Century Tower, just northwest of Senshaw. They can let you know the current location of your fighting dragons. I'll head to the West Century Tower at once. I'll work with Captain Sai Sahan to formulate a plan of attack. We'll march north of Senshaw. As soon as we are able. Okay. But yeah, guys, I do think that's where I'm going to go ahead and end this episode. It does look like the next one will be the last one. I'll probably make it the last one, even if it is super long. We shall see. But yeah, don't forget to leave a like on this video if you enjoyed it. Maybe consider supporting my coffee or Patreon if you want to help out with the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.